So is it true, Connor, that all the girls on all three programs are just falling madly in love with your Irish accent? <laughs> Uh, I wish it was so, I wish it was so, but, uh... I mean, do you... Do you take insult at all their jokes at you, or is that just an Irishman's sort of, you know... Nah, sure, it's like an Irishman, you have to laugh at yourself, so... I was encouraging more than anything else. So to laugh at themselves? Yeah, to laugh at me more so than themselves. Right. But you'd like them to laugh at themselves a little bit too, a bit more, maybe? Yeah, maybe a bit more, yeah, yeah. Are they a pretty serious lot compared to you Irish kids? Yeah, but there's a few now who do kind of take... Take a good joke, though. Take a good joke. Yeah. All right. Well, now, you gave a speech on uh, Monday at the Canadian Embassy on social media and your experience with it. So tell us how that went and what 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 struck home for you in that whole discussion. Yeah, it was grand. It was a bit nerve-wracking, uh, to be honest with you. Um, I'd never given a speech before in front of a group like that. Uh, it was nice to, to talk about my own experience. Um, have listened to everybody else's experience for the last couple of weeks and just let people know what I did and... Um, yeah, I really got a lot out of it now, I think. Um, maybe I was prepared for a bigger group, but uh, I, I still enjoyed it. I still enjoyed having that experience of being able to talk to people anyway, mm -hmm. through, through what, I was, what I did in the, uh, in the past. And um, so again, what, tell us, give us a progress update on, on the Facebook site. Are you, are you happy with the way it's going and where, what's next? Yeah, it's going well you now. It's uh, we're up to. I say we're on about third week, maybe of the page, and we're up to 162 likes. Um, we could be doing a bit better, maybe if people uh, spread the word a bit more, mm -hmm. uh, encourage their friends to join. But uh, I'm happy enough with it. Um, we're doing this with like no budget, with no advertising. So mm -hmm. for that as well, it's a good. It's a good number. Uh, Twitter as well. We have 44 volts. 44 uh, followers. Not 33. Not 33 and a third. No. Uh, 44 and a quarter. 44 <laughs> followers. Uh, which again, it's not a bad number because um, again, we're, we haven't got much um, to promote it with. Um, again, we need a kind of word of mouth kind of thing for that. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I'm happy with it. I'm happy with it. I'm, I'm, I think we're getting good, uh, good. Um, Coverage of it. I think people are kind of impressed with how well the page is, and mm -hmm. like even with that guy from Egypt, it still amazed me. They left like, the cell phone number and called someone in Egypt to give him a call. So that that's what challenging. was that story? Tell me that story. There's a guy from Egypt who found a page, and he obviously didn't read what it was about, and he was saying, "Are you only in uh, in the Middle East or in Israel and Palestine? Uh -huh. And uh, if you're ever, if you're ever in Egypt, call me on this number." And ah. So that was pretty impressive, you know. I think it took uh, is it Lee Diamond? Uh, he's, yeah. He had to explain. No, no, it's a, it's an internship in DC, and but yeah, it was, it was that was interesting. I had to be able to put a page. So making friends in Egypt. Yeah. 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 Great.